Hey there guys, Solo here, and I want to talk to you guys about a sequel I am really looking forward to. For those who have not played the previous game, which is out right now, I advise you to go and get this. And from the title of the video, you guys know what I'm talking about. But Trails of the Cold Steel, sorry, Trails of Cold Steel 2. I keep saying the Cold Steel, but it's Cold Steel. Uh, yeah, it's a game that is being currently translated by XSeed, of course, and... Uh, Probably recently, I think it was like yesterday or a few days ago, but XC on their Facebook page said that the game was actually almost being fully translated. It's at the 95% mark of it being translated. And in terms of editing, it's at the 42nd, sorry, the 42 or 43 mark. Well, in the 40s in terms of editing too. So, so yeah, they're right on schedule. Thank God. So yeah, the game is actually going to be coming out pretty soon. They're, they're aiming for the 2016 mark which is something I actually think is gonna happen because I kinda can't, I can't really imagine them waiting till like next year for the game to come out and they're almost finished translating the game and they're 45 percent complete with the editing that would be kinda odd now for those who have not played Trails of Cold Steel 1 I highly advise you to play this game if you are a fan of JRPGs and or someone who would just want to try out a JRPG just to try it out you know because they're probably tired the Tell series are probably tired of Final Fantasy or all that. Then I would, uh, I, I would highly, highly, highly advise you guys to play Cold Steel One. This game actually reminds me of how much I love JRPGs so much. This reminds me of how much I loved them when I was playing the PS2 games, which, in my opinion, was the golden days of of well, the games from my from my my gaming experience. The PS2 days were the golden days of of Japanese JRPGs. I mean, you had the Xeno Saga series, you had the Tail series, you had the SMT series, even though I didn't really play it till the PS3 era. Uh, you have the Final Fantasy series, even though even though PS2 Final Fantasy games aren't as aren't as loved as much as the older ones, they were still pretty good too. I personally enjoy Final Fantasy 12. I'm not a lot of people agree with that, but hey. And yeah, well, well, like seriously, and the Suikin series, even though Suikin 4 is again like a game people were kind of uh, like meh about. I never played Sudokin 2, or sorry, not 2, 3. Of course, to play Sudokin 5, that game is actually pretty badass. I highly advise anyone to play Sudokin 5. But anyway, I'm getting off off topic though. <laughs> but then again, when, when do I don't get off topic? So yeah, um, I, I highly advise anyone to play Cold Steel 1. It's 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 very fun. The story is pretty cool. The gameplay is amazing. Like <laughs> I remember Kotaku saying it's like Persona and Sudokin mixed together which is no way shape or form anything bad from my opinion and actually it does remind me of persona with the social links and the all-out attack and everything like seriously if you're a fan of persona then get that game that the game you're, you're gonna feel right at home too uh, and that and along with the scheduling the, the scheduling is not as harsh as persona the persona series is but still but anyway that, that's just me going on random tang tangencies like I always do but you know the second game is actually being translated I'm I'm <laughs> I really look forward to it I kind of spoiled myself and that's where I spoiled that I spoiled myself and saw um, bits and pieces of there so I kind of know who joins and who stays and uh, you know who you fight against and everything so I don't really mind that I mean I'm not I'm not gonna tell anyone that too for, for those who are very hard on about not being a spoiler but it's gonna be a good game I really am looking forward to this game, like, ugh, so cool. So anyway, that's pretty much all I want to talk about. Me nerdgasming over, I'm sorry, nerdgasming over Trails of Cold Steel 1 and looking forward to Cold Steel 2. And that's pretty much everything I say. I feel like I should have said something else, not I forgot. Oh well. So, anyway guys, that's me talking about this game. And again, if you guys have not played the game, Go and get it. If you have the money, go and get it. I advise you. If you have some money on your pocket right now and you're watching this video, if you happen to be watching this video and you're like, you know what, maybe I should go out there and buy a game just to try it out. Get Cold Steel 1. If not, you are kind of crazy. <laughs> but then I'm crazy too, so I can't really talk. Anyway, that's all for me, guys. And if you guys have any thoughts about Cold Steel 1, tell me how you feel about the game. Do you guys like it? If you don't like it, I'm actually kind of surprised if you don't like it. But if you do, I'm, well to listen and share my responses to you guys and always give me a like on the bottom of the video it really helps me out guys so anyway i'll see you guys later